Hi, my name is Lauren, and I'm a consultant here at Rotiv. We're an official Salesforce partner, and we help small businesses automate their processes. Today, I'm going to show you how to create an Opportunities Created by Week report. But first, a quick note. We actually have an entire playlist on our YouTube channel dedicated to reports and dashboards. So I highly recommend you check that out for more tutorials like this one. So we're going to go into Salesforce, into our Reports tab. If you don't see your Reports tab, you can always find it in the App Launcher by searching for Reports. We're going to create a new Opportunities report. And then the first thing I like to do is edit filters. So show me all opportunities is good. Keep in mind that this sometimes defaults to show me my opportunities. So you're going to want to change that if you want to see all opportunities. For the close date, I'm going to do current fiscal year. And because this is any opportunity created per week, we're going to leave the opportunity status as any. Back in the outline, I'm going to clean up our fields because we don't need all of them, but you can keep whichever fields that you think are relevant for your business and report. <laughs> and then we are going to group rows by created date. From here, we can add a chart. We go with the column chart for Rotive. You can choose to show a reference line. If there's a certain number of opportunities you want your team to be hitting every week. So for example, two is obviously very low, but when you type that in, you can now see your reference line in comparison to the number of opportunities created that week. One last thing we got to do is we need to group the close date by calendar week, not by day, and change the name of our report. Hit save and run. It'll default to saving into your private reports folder. Just select a public folder. It could be public reports, might be all folders. Let's just say public reports. That way other people can have access to it if they have access to that folder. And that's it. You have your opportunities created by week. You can see by what week. You can see the reference line that we put in for our goal amount of opportunities that we want created each week and all the other details. I hope you found that helpful. Again, we have an entire playlist on our YouTube channel dedicated to reports and dashboards. So I highly recommend you check that out to see other tutorials like this one. If you found this video helpful, please click like. And if you would like more Salesforce tutorials like this, please click subscribe. Thanks for watching.